So with Sinner having to go back into this court case hearing with WADA after they appealed a couple of days ago, Carlos Alcaraz was actually asked in the press conference what he thought about this whole situation. Let's go have a listen to what he had to say. This is what Alcaraz was asked in the press conference about his opinion on what this means for the reputation of tennis and also what this case means. And he said, well, yeah, as you said, it's really sensitive things to Yannick and tennis in general. I mean, after everything was decided, let's say, before Cincinnati, that the ITIA said that Yannick Sinner saying he didn't do anything wrong and now came again, it is open again. I think with tennis, it's not really good. Not really a good sign for tennis in general. It seems like something happened, but you know, after one month, I thought it was closed. Anything is going to happen. Yannick is innocent, and they saw that Yannick didn't do anything wrong. So I started thinking about it and start thinking about myself. This month, I didn't know what happened exactly. I just saw the news, and it surprised me a little bit. Okay, what's going on that the case is open again? I don't know how it's going to be the next month. For sure, to tennis, not a good sign. There it is. That's what Elkris had to say, and he, yeah, he says that that Yannick was innocent. He was proven innocent in that first case and that this is not good for tennis. And I agree with him. This is not good for tennis. I know some people are thinking, well, you know, we've got to get rid of Sinner and whatever. And that's fine. If you don't, if you believe that's okay, but it's not a good look for tennis if he does get banned. I mean, the world number one getting banned for something like this would be bad for the whole sport. It would make the whole sport look bad. So let me go to the comments below. What is your opinion on all this? I, I tend to agree with Alcaraz. It's not good for tennis, no matter what the outcome. I mean, it's such a dark story for tennis in 2024. Carlos Alcaraz asked in the press conference what he thinks about this new phase of the Yannick Sinner case. 